Hey guys, uh, just wanted to catch you up on uh, the jump off. Uh, I had people asking me about the jump off. Uh, it was tough. So this this um, section will be from Teleco to the NOC, NOC. Um, it was no joke. I thought it, it was going to be like eight eight point one miles, and I was like, oh okay. You know, I've been doing, you know, the other day I did 13 something and I did okay, so this will be an easy day. Well, I did it pretty fast, um, but I didn't do it. I mean, I didn't, uh, I mean, I wore myself out. <laughs> um, but I will tell you when I got to jump, uh, the jump off, now it was rugged coming down. Uh, when I got to the jump off, um, I was standing there sort of pondering, and you'll see a picture of me that Walrus took when he, he came up on me. Thank goodness he was my uh, trail angel. Oh, my goodness. If he hadn't have been there, I probably would still be there. <laughs> um, it was, I think the older you get, and I was talking to another gentleman that was, well, he's younger than I was, but he... He said that he was, the older he's gotten, he's more afraid of heights. So I don't know if you guys can relate to that or if anybody knows that to be true or why that would be true. Um, but anyway, uh, when I saw that, I was like, oh my goodness. Uh, it's rock. I had to sit on my behind and sort of wiggle myself down. Um, and if I hadn't have had Waldrus there, uh, Waldrus, to give me confidence to do it and say I could do it and say, yeah, yeah, you're putting your foot right and, you know, that's good and, you know, blah, blah, blah. I mean, he just, he tore it up as far as uh, inspiring me to go ahead and do it and get it done and get off the mountain. However, you're not going to see any pictures. The only pictures you're going to see is of me on the side where he came up on me pondering what I was going to do. Um, and it certainly wasn't going to be going down right away. It was going to be, what am I going to do here? <laughs> you know? So thank goodness he came along. Uh, you'll see him in the film. And Waldrus, if you're out there, thank you, thank you, thank you. You were my trail angel. You did your, your due diligence that day in helping me uh, get, get, you know, get off the um off the jump off otherwise like i said i'd have been up i'd still be up there <laughs> so if that tells you guys anything and it was rocky coming down it was uh, it was really rocky um beautiful i mean i can't say enough about how pretty it was but it was just a challenge for me so anyway just to let you know this is what this is about Okay, guys, uh, enjoy the views. Wiser, uh, I went up to Wiser. Uh, though, and I didn't go up to the tower because I'd been there before, but um, it was it was neat. You'll see that. And all right, well, just enjoy. And thanks again for watching. I appreciate all the comments. And by the way, now I'm getting. I'm getting sort of tired and worn out and all that kind of stuff. So what's going to happen is probably I'm not going to be, unless you've got a specific question, I'm probably just going to be uh, giving you, uh, you know, a, a smiley face or whatever they, they give you. Uh, I won't be answering questions like I had because I'm just, there's just too many of them and I appreciate them. Don't get me wrong. I appreciate every comment and, and they keep me going. If it wasn't for the comments, uh, I, I don't know what I'd do. So keep them coming, and I appreciate it. And uh, thanks for following along with me. I appreciate you coming along with me. I'm taking it slow. I'm a little, I've been off the trail a few days now because uh, I'm not eating enough. I don't know if you can tell my voice. Um, I'm having a little allergy thing come on, and I'm not, um, I'm not sleeping well. And, and that's even at home, and I'm not um, I'm not drinking enough, so that's all my fault. So I will 
I will do better and I will learn how to do this. So just hang in there with me and let me get caught up and let my body get caught up and adjust and uh, we'll get this thing done. <laughs> All right, ladies and gents, thanks again. Love you. Appreciate you more than you know. And uh, enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Well, good morning, guys. I'm here at Teleco Gap. Uh, I'll turn you around and let you see it. It's big old uh, electrical power lines, and then you hit up the big hill. I'll show you that in a minute, too. Uh, but anyway, we're starting out uh, it's about 740 or so, and uh, got about 8.1 miles to go. I'm hoping most of it downhill, because I'm hoping. <laughs> okay, let me turn you around. Here we go. See, there's the big old tower. Well, I don't think you can see it. There we go. There it is up there. There's a bunch of these towers going downhill. Look at that spotty, pretty sky, blue sky today. And you come out from over there, and then you come on up over here. And there's another tower back there. I don't know if you can see it or not. And, uh, and there's the sun coming out. So it's going to be a gorgeous day, they say. But this is what I'm seeing so far. And then this is the trail so far. So I hope it's as good as it started out. Okay, later. All right, this is what they're giving me this morning so far. But it's nice. It's right on the side of the mountain. You can't see too much. It hadn't gotten awakened down there yet. But uh, it's pretty. It's going to be a pretty nice day. Not a pretty nice day. It's going to be a real nice day. All right, and then here's my dancing trees that look like they're, some of them are dying off, I don't know. And then it's going on up the side of the mountain. We're just going straight up this morning. A little about a mile, mile and a quarter or something like that. Okay, later. Here's a little bit better view of that valley we couldn't see this morning. It's a little socked in. Still socked in a little bit, but still pretty. In between these two mountains right here. Just gorgeous. There we go. There's a Y. Wiser Tower. Right there. You come up. Come up from down there. Good little walk. And then you walk up there to the tower. And then, this is partially what you see. It's a little hazy this morning. There we go. It's gorgeous, but it's really hazy. But, Just fabulous. So that's what I'm seeing. So I'm not going to go up on the tower because it's just just going to see more haze with that sun coming in. So I'm hoping, and I think I will later on, get some good. And I hope you're seeing this because it's hard to. It's beautiful later hearing some birds come out this morning it's not giving me much but it's still like 10 o'clock so i guess the haze hasn't burned off yet Pretty.
it's clearing up a little bit over here on the east, I mean west side. It's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And here's a trail. I think we're getting close to the jumping off place. But then we go around here on the west side. And you can see it, but not as well. I think we'll get down here with the jump off or whatever. We'll get a good view. Okay, later. So hazy today, I hate it. But you know, we gotta get what the trail gives us, so we'll take it. So just beautiful day. Oh my goodness. Just fabulous. Alright, so we come down the hit mountain a little bit, and this is what we're seeing. It's gorgeous. I think this is the jump off spot. I'm a little concerned right here. Once I go down there, it's going to be take off pack or something. <laughs> Later. You got a person on the side of you. There's somebody yeah. coming down the yeah, jump good. off up there, and that's where we came from. It has been a challenge for yeah, old past. Right Here's, you want to be on YouTube? Here's Walrus. Here's, he's been my trail angel today. He came along about the time. As we both heard we, we needed each other. We need, I need to slow down and you need to get down. <laughs> I need to really get down. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about you, Walrus. I'm from Rutherford, North Carolina. I've spent the last 15 years in Peruta. Um, but now, finished up with that. Um, changing careers, sold our business, and uh, oh. saved some time. So what what business? I owned a, uh, a river tubing and a campground business in Saluda, mm. North Carolina. Wow. And uh, we did that for about 15 years and we had our fill of it and moved, moved to the next venture. So, All right. So well, congratulations. Thank you. Well, thank you so much. You've no. helped. You helped. No, that would, you they would have been a pacifier over the side of the <laughs> mountain if you hadn't come along. All right. All right. Later, guys. Here we are over here on the western side. And it just feels like you can just reach out and touch these mountains. It's beautiful. And here's a trail alongside here. Um, and you'd go way down there. I don't know if you can tell, but... It's way down there if you miss the step. So I'm going to put this phone up so y'all don't see me fall on YouTube. Later. Today's just been a day of views. Just gorgeous though. Wish y'all could be here. Glad you come along with me. Later. Cute little water source. Of course it's at the end of the day. There hasn't been much water. But uh, it is gorgeous. It's like little amazing how it's cut in there 
I hope I can show it to you. Without me turning it the wrong way. Y'all know I'm good at turning it the wrong way. And there it goes too. So I gotta go across there and over there. So I gotta get my little feet wet at the end of the day. Oh well. It'll feel good. It's a warm day. Later. Beautiful rock guarding the trail. Sort of jaggedy, like the river was cut. I mean, the creek was cut with these little, it's like somebody took and jaggied up these, jaggied, that's a nice word, isn't it? Jagged up the rocks. Oh, but they're gorgeous. All right. And then you got the moss on the other side, and then we're gonna climb for a minute. I swear this tells you it's all downhill, and then you get to going, and it ain't all downhill. But at least this is not um, what do you call it? Not like it was up on on jump off. Oh lordy. I had vertigo up there. Anyway, we're going into the knock in a minute. Later. Well, here I am at the knock. Oh, we can hear the water. Uh, this is the back of the little store over there. And then there's the little other store. And see if I don't get hit here. I can walk across the road and show you that other little store. Um, here it is. Busy today. NOC rafting. Here's a little store you can come and get. Get some stuff that you need. And then there's River's End. Where you can get you some food. Right on the water. And of course, here's the little outfitters here. And my ride's not right here, but they should be here in a minute. I it's six minutes or so. So, anyway, this is it. Beautiful. Yeah, there's a little outfitters over there, outfitter store. Hey, later. So here we are on the Natahalo. They're over there practicing in the day. Beautiful day. I mean, just gorgeous. Must be having some kind of school over there. Of course, if you go that way, you're headed north over the bridge. And I think we're going to go into Rivers Inn. And have some lunch right beside the river. Later.